Okay, let's go to the next question from Kathy, beginner level. She says, we are in our late 50s. We're learning salsa and my husband feels dizzy when he turns. He didn't seem to get dizzy during swing lessons. Is it because salsa is a faster music? Is there a trick to not getting dizzy during the turns? That's a great question, Kathy. So first of all, I think the biggest difference between turning and swing and salsa is in swing, you have a lot of triple steps. So when you do a turn, you don't have to turn like within one step, yeah, or one count you really have triple step to turn. So it's, it's a lot more gradual. Where, versus in salsa, it would be one, two, three, like it's a very quick turn, quick 360 turn in salsa versus swing. You can space out the turn uh, in f for uh, two counts or three steps, like one or two, yes? So, so that's, the, that's why he probably feels um, uh, more dizzy in the salsa turns versus swing. Now, what can he do to not feel as dizzy? Um, one of the things he can do is spot, okay? Spot, uh, I ha I've done some videos on that. We have a how to turn technique lesson, so I covered spotting in there, so you can check it out. But spotting means when you're turning, you look at one spot, and then as you turn, you, can, you keep your head looking at the spot, so even when my shoulders turn, I keep looking at that spot, and then I swing back to that spot. So just coming back to the same spot that I started can sometimes help uh, the person not be so dizzy. Uh, the other thing is just really understanding your footwork and um, that can help as well so that you can be more efficient with your spins um, and then it just takes time after that, okay?